Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to take you through um, all of my lip products. So these are all of my lipsticks, lip glosses. This is what I've got to show you. This one is by the brand NYC. What is brown colour? I think I got this one in a bag. It's called Mocha, shade 304. Really gorgeous. I haven't used this too much. I might have to throw that in my handbag. Quite like that one. Hmm. Colourpop. I love Colourpop. I had a few more of these but I lost them. I don't know where they are, but I'm really gutted. And I love the smell of these. They smell so good. They're just so easy to apply. This one is in the shade Addict. Really easy to wear, um, really comfortable. One that I have and I love is this Topshop one. Really, really cute packaging, not gonna lie. That was partly why I bought it. This is called Nevada. Really nice, really nice nude color. Love that one. Love it. I'm going to show you is this Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick in Laguna Beach. Now I didn't even know I had this. Again, I think I got it, must have got it in some goodie bag. I was cleaning out my makeup and then I was like, oh, I wonder what this is. And then I saw the Kathleen Knights did a video on it and I was like, mm, hello. So then I tried it on and I love it. It's such a, such a gorgeous colour. Really easy to wear. Love it. It's so long lasting. Can't get them in New Zealand. Only can buy them online, which is really annoying. I want more. I want more. Next two that I'm going to show you. These ones have been in my collection forever. They are from L'Oreal. Both from the colour Re Reach. I've actually got the shade 453. Um, in rose, rose cream. And in 311, some like it scarlet. This is a much loved product. As you can tell, there's not much left. Um, this is the Sun Like It Scarlet, the 453, more of a rose colour, my lips but pinker, that's the thing. Next I've got these two gorgeous silver bullets, they are from Phoenix Cosmetics, Phoenix is a New Zealand brand, really nice and vibrant colours of the two that I got is Flirt, really nice bright colours, Love Struck, love the names, I love that orange one. Forgot about it. The one I have is a Milani lip gloss. This is one of their Brilliant Shine lip glosses in the shade 11 Nude Touch. Really nice nude with a little bit of sparkle gloss. Really good to go over any lipstick. Give it that bit more, bit more of a shine really. Next look I have this one is from Revlon. Um, and this is in the shade 245 Smoky Rose. Now this is a really nice, really nice deep brown colour. Mm. Just really easy basic to wear kind of colour. These two are also from Revlon. I love these ones because they've got the colours on top. So you can just easily visualise what you want to wear and just be like, oh yeah, that wouldn't do me. I've got the colour 085 Ruby. And this is the one I'm currently wearing on my lips. And as you can tell, it is a much loved one. 096. Again, a loved, much loved lipstick. And I'm going to cry when these two run out. So next I have the two of the NARS pencils. These I got in a my birthday from Sephora and I'm not one to give up free gifts so <laughs> this one is called Cruella. Really nice um, deep red, really smooth and buttery, really buttery velvet matte lip pencil and this one is Regurgan. Regurgan. I'm not sure if I'm saying it correctly um, and it is a satin lip pencil. That is definitely a My Lips Bit Better. The other two colours there. These pencils are the best thing. I just wish you could get them in New Zealand and I would have the whole collection. So I've got a few NYX lipsticks. This one here, this one here is called Chloe. It's a really nice pinky red with really good, really nice sheen to it. I don't know if you can see that. It's got a really nice sheen to it. Shade 521 Chloe. And then I have four of their butter lipsticks. They're so good. But I have the shade Sweet Tart BLSO2. The shade Fireball. Love that name. And BLSO6. I've got a Bit of Honey. I love this one. I'm a really nerd person. Bit of honey, and that is BLS20. And last one is Taffy, um, and that is BLS14. Nick's really cheap and expensive 
lipsticks. These ones are just, like they said in the title, they're so buttery, so easy to put on. The next collection I'm going to take you through is my Maybelline collection. One of the elixirs, and it's in the shade 20. Really nice vibrant red lip gloss. Quite sticky, quite thick, um, but it is really nice if you're going out. I then have four of the Colour Sensational lipsticks. I think I have more, but I gave them away to my sister. This one is 420 in Coral Pop. Gorgeous, gorgeous orange. Love it. Love it. I just, I don't know how else to describe it, but I love it. <laughs> there I have our nudes. First one is 710 Sultry Sand. That's a really light white based nude. The next one is 725 Tantalizing Torp. Now this one is more of your brown nudes. Really like that. Really like that kind of um, nude. Just gives it just gives it a bit more colour. And then this one is one of my favourites and it is 740 in Coffee Craze. They smell really good too. Mm. And the next three that I oh no, I have one more. 904 Wild Rose. Now isn't that a hot pink? That is a hot pink. Whew. And now I've got I've got two mattes from the matte bold line. This is matte five. So that's matte five there. And matte six. You can see matte six is a lot darker. And you can see on my hand there there's matte five and matte six. And I really like them. These are my Gerard Cosmetics lipsticks and lip glosses. I have the shade 1995 gorgeous brown lipstick and Kimichi Doll. Love this nude. Love this nude. It's like a really nice, nice bright pinky nude. And then I have two lip glosses. This one is Cocoa Bean. Nice dark brown. Definitely recommend these ones to go over a lipstick. Uh, that is Cocoa Bear. However, that is very pigmented and does not. Um, but I just prefer them, you know, to go under a over a lipstick. And now this one here is Candy Kiss. This is um, Shannon Harris, Shan XO's lip gloss. I really love this one on top of my ColourPop Addict. It just makes such a nice glossy, glowy lip. It's just, oh, just phenomenal. And the thing I do love about these is the light on the inside and the mirror on the side of the lip gloss. So wherever you are, you have no excuse. And now these are my two golden babies. These are the Marc Jacob lip glosses. My mum got these for me for my birthday when she was in Canada. And I got Sugar Sugar and Pretty Thing. Sugar Sugar. And I love the applicator. It's so easy to put onto your lips. And this one here is pretty thin. So this one's a little bit more darker. Definitely need to wear this one over a lipstick just because they aren't as pigmented and they definitely are lip glosses, but that's totally fine by me. But gorgeous lip glosses. Now we come to my last lot of goodies. This is my MAC lot. If you are from New Zealand, MAC is so expensive. A MAC lipstick in New Zealand is about $44. Um, and in the States it's about 16 so massive price difference. The first one I have to show you here is a MAC Dazzle Glass Cream. It is more of a lip gloss. Again, this is something that I would recommend putting over a lipstick. Really nice thick application. Got that glitter through it so it's really more of like an event one to wear out to an occasion. But it's just, I love the packaging. I love that little bow on it. So cute. Ooh, this one looks like it's melted a little bit. This one is the Dazzle Lipstick Smash Hit. 101 sparkles in it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I bought this when I was in America. Absolutely love it. Love it. And this one here is MAC Red. Solid basic red. Staple is one, a limited edition one. Um, it is from the Cinderella line. I got the shade Free as a Butterfly. Now I love this one. I love the nude on it. I wish it wasn't limited edition because I'm so scared to wear it out. Great for every day. And I am a nerd and keep it in the box because I love Cinderella. I love Disney. And then my last two are from the, the MAC Beaver Glam range. The first one I've got is by Lady Gaga. 
and it is called Viva Glad and Gargato. I'm going to be so gutted when this one runs out because I have used it non-stop. It's a really nice nude with brown undertones. And now this is the first Miley Cyrus one. Um, again, keep this one in this box because I'm a freak. <laughs> so this is Viva Glam Miley Cyrus. It is a rockin' hot pink. Like, how, how sick is that? That is so cool. And I can't wait to compare it to the red that she's just brought out. But yeah, so thank you for sitting through my lipstick collection. Um, I know I don't have a ton, but for me that is a lot. As you can see, I'm more in the red, pink, nude kind of space. I really want to branch out a little bit and wear a bit more colours. Let me know your favourite lipsticks down in the comment section below. And let me know what kind of brands I need to look out for next. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next week.